Okay, Bob, we're back again. Uh, this is your Holton Lake job. Okay, so we got, I'm going to hit save here. Okay, so it's, when there's two names up there, just put and. That little symbol there. Okay, go over here. We're going to hit Michigan again. Hit this drop down, and we're going to hit Michigan. Yep, right there. Dry, we can spell that out. Okay, we'll get rid of the listing agent. We'll keep Jeannie there, the buyer's agent. Okay, nice cover photo. Let's see. Some hanging, hanging insulation. We'll get to that later, I'm sure. Yeah. Let me see what you got over there in the insulation part. The perimeter, per, perimeter, the perimeter foundation was should be insulated on there. Okay. So let's go back over here, the floors. Further. Evaluate the floor structure when insulation is removed. Refer to 8 point, no, it is 8.1. Right, so let me go over here. We'll put 8.1. 8.1, and we'll just make that bold. There we go. Good job. Okay. Okay. We get rid of this. Repair is necessary. Siding. So. You know, I mean, it is what it is. If needed. Put if needed. Or if desired or whatever. I mean, I don't even know. I mean, it is what it was. Just get rid of that. It's in there. The main thing is you mention it. It's not, it is not detrimental that it needs to be repaired. I mean, they could leave it that way. Good. Good. Well, we got a balance and got a are not installed on the front porch deck. That 20 should be installed from the deck floor. Uh, let's see. We can get rid of that part right there. I think whoever installs it knows the, you know, we don't need to say that somebody's going to fall out and hurt themselves. Dog, pet, child, you know, we don't want nobody getting hurt and we don't want to suggest nothing. All right, so let's, let's see. The bell hairs are needed with, we'll just leave it at that. Very good. That's good enough. All right, then we'll take that out of there. Yep. Good, good. Back with you here. How's this looking here? We got some missing shingles or what? We'll put an hour on that. If it was just one, but it looks like several. Several so shingles or no? Let me look. Let me let me blow them up. Maybe it's just a couple of shingles. I guess the gravity of it. Let me see. Okay, I see what's happening. 
some patchy. Okay. And yeah, some repairs. Okay, not too bad. Not as bad as I thought it would from when I did blow them up. So, okay, so a few things are missing or something, but should be repaired. Okay, we'll just leave the auto off of it. How's that plumbing good look? Well, doesn't look too bad. Okay, well, just, we'll just leave it, I guess. Yep. Maybe you've seen something that I can't. Good. So I, I'm not following you here, Bob. Let's see. We got um, right here. At the time of this fact, there was very limited water to go home. One fossil would operate for a third, and then the water slow would stop. Recovery slow at time of inspection. Okay, so I'm going to copy this. Copy. And then we're going to put over here. You got water flow. Is over here, here, here. So this is either wrong or the other one is wrong. One of these is wrong, so. Looks like the water flow there is good, so not quite sure. Let me see what this says again. Let me read that one more time. To the home. All right, so we'll just go from there. Let me just move it. Okay, good. Okay, so this is a gas meter, so we can get rid of the propane here. Right there, so we just keep the utility company can pressure test gasoline. Good. Okay, I'm going to have to grab that, so let me put you on hold. Oh, okay, somebody else grabbed that. So, busy Monday morning, so here we go. Okay, what we got here? Yep, good. Good. We can just exclude that. If there's nothing there. Okay. Good. 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 Okay. Okay, good. We got this going. This going here. Oop, I didn't mean to do that. Good. Smoke detectors. Okay, recommend replacing batteries. Get rid of that. We're going to say recommend replacing battery when moving into home. Just keep it like that. Okay. Okay, so we don't want to say all this. That's pretty alarming. So we just want to. So we just. Recommend. Installing smoke detector, and we'll put an R. You got the R there, good. 
So you know we got this. So let me just open this up. So you can go in here and just edit this with that little wrench there, and then we're gonna put replace batteries. We're gonna that's way to be there next time when you go there. Recommend replacing batteries when moving into home. And then you hit OK and then cancel and then it'll be there for you next time. So carbon monoxide, there was no carbon monoxide detected. Okay. Well, I usually don't put an R there unless it's like a situation where you need one, depending on the age of the furnace. Let's see how old the furnace is. It's a wall furnace. Yeah, those are usually pretty dependable. So, um, you know, just you got it in there. We don't need it in the R. Now, if it's like a, you know, really old furnace and, you know, or a ventless space heater or something like that, then there should be an R there. But anyways, for this one, we don't need an R. Okay, and then we got the wall. Okay, so this is a wall furnace. So let's put wall furnace. Wall furnace was normal. Flu and fan. There was no fan on. There was no flu and draft fan. That's a draft fan. So we just say flu was drafty. Properly timed this fan. Blow was right. So on this particular one, there's no draft inducing fan. So pretty good. And this is not a high efficiency furnace. So heat exchanger had no visibility due to its high to its efficiency design. So um, on this typical one, it, we just we didn't just get rid of this. There we go. There you go. So we just get rid of that because that was for high efficiency. I think you should have a comment for wall furnace here. Well, this would be a good comment for wall furnace. This one right here. Just put wall furnace. Yep. Good. However you want to do. It. Anyways. The wall furnace doesn't have a high efficient, you know, the limited X to the heat exchanger and all that good stuff. This here, I usually want to make sure there's a heat vent in every room. Duck works on each room. Each room had a function of heat source. I usually will put that comment down here. I always got to make sure every room has got a heat source. If it doesn't, you got to mention it. Okay, so the metal lamp, uh-huh, good. Uh huh. Good. Great. Good. Good. It is needed. Yeah, we'll just say it's needed instead of necessary. Mm -hmm. Good, good. I uh, want oh, too many E's there. Let me back. There we go. As needed. Okay, you got an hour already. Very good. Insulation was not. Insulation was not visible. Uh -oh. Insulation was not visible only on E1. Let me just put it this way. Insulation was visible only at E1. Okay, we'll leave it at that. Very good. 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 Your driver is anything outside. That's me.
So is this a gas electric or so what is this? A gas or electric? Good. Good comment. So let, let me see what we got here. It's electric and gas hookup. So what do we got here? There is no dryer. Take it, there's no dryer. Let me see. But it was a stackable unit. So, okay, what are you saying here? So, what is this? Is this a, let me look at the pictures. Is this electric dryer? Or is it a gas dryer? Let's see if we can see some pictures here. Mm. I don't see anything there that would indicate that it would be a gas or electric. Is that a gas pipe there? It is a gas pipe. So that is gas. Where's the other picture here? Yep, there's a gas pipe. I see it. All right, so this is a gas pipe. So let's put that in the dryer. But it's venting. There's not venting outside. This is a gas dryer. This is a gas dryer, and it needs to be vented to the exterior of home. There we go. Very good. Good. All right, what do we got here? Dishwasher. Mm -hmm. Disposal. Yeah. Good. 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 Okay, very good. So, let me hit find next. All answers. Let's take a look and see how it looks here, Bob. Good job, as always. Okay. <clears throat> You know, I'm thinking maybe we should put an R on those shingles. There's not a whole lot going on here, so. Yes, let's let's add a, an R there to repair those shingles, and then this plumbing thing. Just a little concerned about that. Um, uh, recovery was so. Uh, I wonder if there was a well. Was there a well at this property? We just didn't do it. Or let me see what it says here. Not inspected. So it must have been a septic in a well there. So let's go here and we're gonna put a. Well, inspection was not what was not performed. This is was not performed with this inspection as it was not ordered. It was not ordered. A well inspection can be done. Upon request, leave it at that. There we go. Good job, Bob. As always, let me just do a <clears throat> upload here, and we're going to send it out. Let me see right here. Okay, so let me go ahead and end this, and I'm going to send it on out. So I'm just going to. Do go through that. What that's going on? I'll disconnect. Thank you.